Hello everyone. Welcome to the online practical class of Virtual University of Pakistan. In this session, we are going to talk about the preparation of temporary mount of onion epidermis. This is an example of plant cell. Uh, we'll go through this step by step. In the beginning, I'll tell you about the equipment and the consumables that will be required for the procedure. Then we'll talk about the procedure, how the experiment works. And after that, uh, we'll uh, go through the observations uh, to identify our specimen. And in the end, uh, we'll consider the mistakes or the errors that the students can make when they are uh, making the experiment for the very first time. So let's start with the equipment and the consumables. If we have a light microscope. This is the light microscope. Okay. Uske baad hame chahiye droppers. Droppers ke saath hame hamara stain chahiye. We need the stain that is methylene blue in this case. We are going to need water. Clean glass slide. Then we will need the cover slip that is square in shape. Also, we are going to need the onion and I have cut it into half. Uh, we'll also need the cuser or the forceps. Okay. Now let's start with the procedure. First of all, we will take a clean glass slide. We will take a droplet of water. Lenge. Now I have got the onion and I'll peel off the hard part of the onion skin and what I need is the fleshy part I'll get one part of it, a smaller part and now I need the onion epidermis how to take it out? I'll take my forceps and now I'm trying to peel off the onion epidermis from the inner part of the leaf. We don't need a big part of it. Let's try. Okay, now I've got a big part of it and I'm going to cut it into smaller one and put it on the slide. Here, now I'm going to put it on the slide, on the droplet of water. Try to avoid any kind of wrinkles in it. This is not a wrinkle. Nahi hona now, we add a stain on it, which is methylene blue. Now, we have to take the other side. इसके वन या टू ड्रॉप्स डालेंगे। Now let it stay for one or two minutes. So now we can see that this is stained and we can now put the cover slip over it. While putting the cover slip, you have to be very careful. Because we do not need any bubbles and we do not need to wrinkle our onion epidermis. This is why you carefully touch your cover slip in angular form with your stain ke saath touch karna hai, and then you can let it fall down very gradually. Like this. So that there are no bubbles. If there are any bubbles, then they can be removed. Okay, and you can see that there is some extra stain on the slide. I have to remove it now with the help of the paper. 
Now the slide is ready for observation. We should put it on the stage of the light microscope. We can now adjust it and view it under 10x objective lens. So what we can see here is the darkly stained nucleus which is found on the periphery of the cell. Then we can see that the cell wall is very distinct and it has got a specific shape. Uh, the cells are looking like a brick and they are uh, tightly packed with each other. You can see the lightly stained cytoplasm and these are all the features of a plant cell. So now we have to talk about the mistakes or the errors that the students can make while making the experiment for the very first time. What can students do in this way? One thing is that when you use your onion epidermis, you don't have to give wrinkles while putting it on the slide. The other thing is that you should know how to use a compound microscope. You should know how to focus the lenses, how the coarse focus and the fine focus works, how to put the slide uh, nicely on the stage and how to identify the cells. If you don't know it, then you should seek guidance from the colleagues or the teacher. Iske ilawa, aapne apne stain ko ingest nahi karna. Aur agar aapke gloves pe ya aapke hands pe stain lag jaye, to do not touch your eyes or your skin with these stained hands. Kyunki ye toxic hai aur aapki skin pe irritation cause kar sakta hai. That's all for performing this experiment. Thank you.